Lord. Praise God in his sanctuary. Praise him in his mighty firmament. Praise him for his mighty acts. Praise him according to his excellent greatness. Praise him with the sound of the trumpet. Praise him with the lute and harp. Praise him with the timbrel and dance. Praise him with stringed instruments and flutes. Praise him with loud cymbals. Praise him with clashing cymbals. Let everything that has breath praise the Lord. Welcome to Music Festival. I'm going to ask you guys to stay seated because they have you in order. You guys, let's stand for opening prayer. Father in heaven, I am grateful that we can be here to be able to praise your name, to thank you, to recognize your grace. I pray that the light will be here with us and that darkness will be banished. We so much look forward to the city where there doesn't need to be a sun that shines forever. Fill us with your Holy Spirit. Thank you for these young people who will be singing praises to your name. In Jesus' name, amen.
Wasn't that amazing? Band, you sound beautiful. Choir, you sound wonderful. Uh, before I, we're just going to take a little pause here, and I'd like to invite uh, Miss Ashley Shebo to please come forward, and Mrs. Jennifer Mueller, uh, Mr. Gabriel Mendez, and Mrs. Pam Roney. Could you please come forward? Just, just come stand by me. Just come stand by me, thanks. Uh, for those of you who are at church today, we were blessed to hear some kids tell their experience in Adventist education. We heard things like, I love my friends, and I, it's a great fun to learn, and I like learning about science because we learn about God and not just evolutionary concepts. You know, we learn that the teachers are kind, that they love you and they help you. These things don't just happen, right? They happen because of faithful teachers who have committed to help students have that wonderful, lovely Adventist experience. In our conference, we love to honor all of our teachers, but especially every five years of service, we like to give a pin to recognize your service. So we're gonna start with Miss Ashley Shebo. You have your 10-year pin. Ashley teaches at Andrews Adventist Academy in Cedar Rapids, grades one to four? Two to four this year, that's right. <laughs> Mr. Gabriel Mendez, 15 years. <laughs> Mr. Mendez teaches grades five and six at College Park Christian Academy in Columbia. All right, Miss. Mrs. Jennifer Mueller, 15 years. <laughs> Jennifer teaches all the grades at Nevada Christian Academy. And Miss Pam Roney, uh, who teaches at Sunnydale Elementary, Adventist Elementary, and she teaches the upper grades, is receiving her 20 year pin. Thank you. Like I said, we appreciate our teachers and that when they have these mile markers, but we also want to acknowledge all of our teachers here. Would our Adventist elementary teachers please stand? <laughs> our academy. Thank you. Thank you. We also want our academy teachers and academy staff members please stand. Our homeschool, our homeschool parents and public school parents who are, are, are teachers who are here, please stand as well. Thank you. <laughs> we appreciate you serving in every different, whatever your mission field is. We know that you're out there ministering for Jesus there, and we just thank you and we thank you all. And on with the concert.
So while we wait for them to set up their percussion and stuff, I decided it might well be my time to talk because I've been in, as I might have mentioned at some other point, in every pretty much stage of being a part of Music Fest so far, aside from being in Karen and Melissa's spots. And so instead, <laughs> I, just <laughs> I just wanted to kind of talk about what a blessing it's been, what an awesome opportunity it's been, um, just to go from being one of the kids that, as I heard, uh, visited not even old enough yet to be part of Music Fest, wearing a spring suit or whatever when it was freezing cold out, then being an actual elementary and middle schooler participating in the songs, one of which we're actually sing singing today, um, actually then going on and being a student here at Sunnydale and being a participant in that way, then leaving, going to Union College, and then coming back to then spend a semester to teach in Mr. Choi's position, see I'd said almost every position, for a semester and work with everyone in that capacity and then now to come 15, 20, I don't know how long it's been, years later to finally come about full circle and be the one that's directing all of them. And they have been doing fantastically. There have been times where we've made some phenomenal sounds of which you've heard them today. There's been times where I was like, mm, let's try that again, many times, let's be honest, but, <laughs> They nailed it, they have continued to do fantastic, are sounding amazing, and I'm just so very glad to have been part of this opportunity, glad to show just what an Adventist ed education can do, what a great education just in general this has been. And I'm gonna call out my friend Josh, who doesn't need to stand or anything like that, don't do it, but we met going to all of these different events and all these different things, coming to Music Fest. He stole one of my solos, no thanks to Kevin Abrahamson, no big deal, but, okay, he did stand this time. But, <laughs> but because of even that, we are best friends to this day. Because of that, I was his best man at his wedding two weeks ago. <laughs> and so, these sort of things are what happens from these opportunities. These are the experiences, these are the friends that they are making now that they will see 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, however long into the future. Many of you have experienced the very same thing. And so it's just such a great opportunity to be a part of this, to be able to see this, to be blessed, and to continue being a blessing in this capacity as well. We're going to keep going.
Wonderful. You guys did so great. Thank you. You know, I, I tallied it up, and you guys practiced. Over the last couple days, they've been in rehearsals for over eight hours. Not in one chunk, but all spread throughout. Eight hours of practicing. That was a lot of work, and it really showed. We're so proud of you. And you know, this event does not come together without a lot of help. So we just want to thank a few people, uh, starting with Mrs. Kirsten Mathis, who does all of the decorating for us and plans everything out and does such a great job every year. And her lovely team of helpers. <laughs> Thank you so much. Uh, we also have been blessed for several years now to have the lovely piano playing of Miss Mrs. Pam Sutter. We're so grateful for you for always sharing your talents. All right, our band director, Mr. Choi. And our choral conductor, Mr. Daniel Ipama. You know, they do, you know, I heard Mr. Choi some, say something once, and I'm probably not going to repeat it as nicely as he did, but it's such a lovely thing when you think about the fact that the kids spent eight hours dwelling on these lyrics right? It wasn't just learning to sing. It wasn't just the lyrics. It was like a master class also on how to read music. So they've learned a lot of theory, but they have really spent time dwelling on these songs and on what their the message is. We just want to thank our guest speakers who came and helped and made this um, each worship a special event. We especially want to thank our teachers and chaperones who've been here for days, sleeping in chapels with a bunch of kids on the floor, <laughs> helping to provide chaperone and doing all they can to make this a success. And we want to thank our students who work so hard. We're so proud of you guys. Thank you. All right, they are dying to sign each other's t-shirts, but we're going to have a closing prayer. One last note, any students who were wanting their artwork back that's hanging in the wall, we do an art contest every year to, uh, where the kids illustrate the theme. And so those, if you didn't get a chance to peruse those in the back, those are the different entries um, that ended up making it to the t-shirts. So, um, but teachers, if you want to go to the back of your students' artwork, you can do that. All right, let's pray. Oh, yeah, let's stand for prayer. Sorry, thank you. Heavenly Father, our hearts are filled by the gifts of these kids, by these workers who have worked so hard to praise your name, to bring kids together to think about spiritual things, Lord, to spend some time just stepping outside of our normal lives and to step into worship with you. We just have had such a blessing, and we ask as we go forward from this place that, of course, we'll have safe travel, but that the light that has been lit in our souls and in our hearts will stay, and that outpouring of your love will shine through us. Thank you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. You are, you are just, I'm going to wait, you're dismissed.